Hey everybody, I'm the Frosty Four, and I'm back with another episode of Dream. Yesterday we discovered some weird rooms with different colors, so let's see what we can figure out today. Whoa, what's this? Oh good, a graveyard. I noticed that on the TV screen yesterday, uh, when we went to the media center. What the hell? I'm gonna put my hand on it? Oh, okay, so here lies something. Okay, so I noticed they all have dots lit up on them. I really hope Uncle Ed doesn't materialize when I get this point. Great. Okay, so let's take a good hard look at this graveyard. They have dots on them. But everyone has a different dot pattern. Is it graveyard? Must be for the camels. Camels? Well, when I turn this one on, the other one turned off. Well. So this one affects. Uh, okay, I get it. So this one affects the one. Uh, oh my god. Now that is a serious puzzle. This is a crazy puzzle, but at least I figured out what I'm supposed to do, I believe. Oh, here we go. Grave. To dream that you are at a grave indicates that you need to delve into your own subconscious in search of an issue that you had thought had long been put to rest. You need to stand up for yourself as no one can do it for you. Graveyard. To dream that you are in a graveyard uh, represents discarded aspects of your ambitions. Alternatively, a graveyard may indicate a loss or period of mourning. Headstone. To see a headstone in your dream represents a forgotten or buried part of your life that must acknowledge uh, to move into the future. Consider also the message on the headstone. It may be a statement about your life worries. Okay, I'm almost not going to figure this out. I'm just going to go back to the color drum. Desert Park. Even though the Fey Mill didn't believe they were worthy enough to live above ground, they would bury respected elders in the community on the surface. This was to give them a second chance to walk with the gods. That concludes our tour, but make sure you have a good look outside the rest of the park as there is still a lot to see. Oh, this is number five. Oh, so this is supposed to be a, a tour. That's why they all have numbers on them. Okay, well, that makes sense. Here we go, so let's go to the colored rooms. Alright, so... Last time we came in here, um, I got to the end of the blue part, and there were three the paths. When Lucid turns intelligible, turning predator into prey. Okay, so anyway, there were th there were the three paths, and last time I went forward. This time I'm gonna go left. Let's see what happens. Oh, there's another path right off the bat. Wait, how's that possible? Okay, okay, okay. Oh man, how am I gonna cover this whole game? I'm gonna get so lost. Oh, what's this one say? Wait, what the fuck? Wait, so I already came this way. Oh, no, no. I just went in a big circle. Wait a second. Is it taking me back into the same place over and over again? It is. Okay, so I guess you can't go left. Wait, but now forward is different. Okay, so if I keep going forward, it just takes me back to the same place over and over again. <laughs> so this is PT! Okay, let's go right this time. Okay, so I didn't go this way yet. How am I supposed to get in there? Whoa! I thought he went through there for a second. Okay, so you can't go through that, go through that part yet. Is that something different? You can peek and peer at Squinton's step, but you'll only see the future clearly when you're there. Okay, what? What the fuck? Okay. Okay. I'm... So now I'm not so much scared as I am just... severely confused. Okay, so last time I went this way. I'm gonna go this way this time. 
in the green way. Well, I guess it's kind of like yellow, green and yellow. It's like olive. Okay, so- Whoa! What the fuck? I went around in a circle and I'm locked in here! Okay! I'll be leaving now, thank you. What? Which way did I come out last time? Wait, isn't that the same way I came out last time? No, I came out the green way. And that's the yellow way. So now I need to figure out how to get out the red way. Okay, but first, I'm gonna go down here. I'm gonna see what this, uh... I wanna see what, uh, that infinite hallway was that I was so scared to go down last time. Okay, so if I go through this portal, it'll take me back to the desert. The Guardian Quandary. But I'm gonna go down this hallway, which... I don't know about you, but... If you've ever had a uh, um, an infinite hallway dream, it's kind of scary. So I'm just gonna run. Oh my god, there's a door or a, a path. Whoa! Whoa! What's this? Can I? What? <laughs> what happens if I jump? I'm just falling. Oh god. Whoa. Holy crap, it's I'm surprising Whoa! Jesus. Oh, I landed on the red one this time. <laughs> oh my god. So it's like an Which way do I go? I go the I'm gonna go this way. This is weird shit. Some top quality weird shit. Okay. So, this is the same place. I just changed the color of this doorway here. But it doesn't really change anything, does it? What happens if I go this way? There's a blue thing. Oh, I'm not jumping down there. What, what happens if I just keep going? It looks like there's something at the end of the hallway, or is that just to taunt me? So, if I just keep running down this hallway, it just keeps repeating red on the right, blue on the left. And if I just keep running, it just keeps doing that. See, here's the doorway. It's going to be red, right? Yep, there's red. And then on the left will be blue. And if I turn back around and go the other way, then I'll just be right back to that portal. Okay, so what happens if I fall down the left one, because I went down the right one. Does the left one take me up or something? I'm kind of scared. That is yellow. Okay. Does it take me anywhere? I'm just right back at the beginning. <sighs> okay. I'm gonna go ahead and leave this episode here. I really hate to say it, but I'm getting very frustrated by this game. I have no direction. I have no idea what I'm doing. I understand that you know these are puzzles, but I have n no idea how to even solve them. Uh, the graveyard puzzle, at least, I might be able to figure out eventually, but this whole colored room thing is really throwing me off. And I don't want this to turn into another thing, you know, like Ethan Carter, where it took me three hours to figure out how to even play the game. So I'm gonna go ahead and leave this episode here. It might be a while before I play this again. Um, I'm just, I'm really getting frustrated. Drop me down in the comments, let me know what you think. Do you see something that I don't? Anyway, if you thought this was awesome, please hit like and subscribe, and maybe I'll come back to it and figure it out. Uh, so I'll chill with you in another video, but until then, stay frosty. Like, we need to buy one of those.